Yo, what's going on guys? It's Shake here today, and today I'm going to be showing you how to improve your FPS and performance in Fortnite by changing your NVIDIA control panel settings and basically just optimizing your graphics card to get better FPS, and this works for any game, not just Fortnite. Alright guys, so I'm going to be showing you my NVIDIA control panel settings that I want you to copy, and then at the end of the video, I'm also going to be showing you a setting that optimizes Fortnite even further to make your graphics card work harder. First thing you want to do is just right click and open up your NVIDIA control panel. Go to adjust image settings with preview. Go to this and drag it. It's going to be at quality. Drag it all the way down to performance and then go to use the advanced because you're going to change the advanced setting. Go to manage 3D settings and here is where all of the FPS is going to come in. You're going to be getting a huge FPS boost by copying these settings. You want to turn image sharpening off and basically I'm just going to scroll through them and but yeah, you want to turn all of these off right here okay and then i turn that off for CUDA cores put that on all off 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 g-sync compatible uh, that just depends on your monitor off for OpenGL rendering select the gpu that you have in your system and this right here is super important make sure it's on prefer maximum performance this is going to give you the best fps boost out of any of this it's, it's default is optimal, but change it to maximum refresh rate, put it at highest available. Turn shader cache and texture filtering on, allow, and then high performance right there. And then on, on, off, off, one, off. And after you do that, just go ahead and apply the settings. And I have a few more settings for you. Go to your change resolution tab. And for your main monitor, just make sure that your refresh rate is at the highest available. A lot of times, like if you update your drivers and stuff, it gets messed up and I mean this is really annoying because you're not going to be getting the most out of your monitor either. So make sure that you have it on the max available. Also if you're really really struggling with FPS I recommend you change your resolution to 1680 by 1050. After you've done this I'm going to be showing you guys a program that will improve your PC's performance overall and then I'm going to be showing you a setting that will optimize your graphics. Go to the link in the description and you're going to see this program that says Smart Game Booster. Just download it, completely safe, and I, in pretty much every video I mention this program because it's amazing. Whenever you, before you run Fortnite, either just click Fortnite and then boost into it or just click boost. Once you click boost, it's going to basically, you can see right here, reduce your CPU usage, unlock your RAM, and slightly overclock your GPU. And trust me, this is all going to be really, really safe and Smart Game Booster just like built in, it's going to, um do that but yes like i said guys this is a completely free program that will boost your pc and make you get the most out of all of your hardware when you're done i just recommend just hitting restore um unless you're either doing some uh intense editing or playing a game just so that way you're not you don't need to use all of your pc's power all of the time so the last thing that i have for you guys is actually a setting built into windows and it's completely safe and it just makes your pc prioritize the game more so all you want to do is just type in graphics settings and open this up. Um, reduce latency and improve performance. Turn this on. It, it basically accelerates your GPU. I, I don't really know the specifics of it, but I know that it will improve your performance. Then here is something that's going to help you. So basically, you want to go to browse and find where your Fortnite is stored. This is the default path for it. So right here, I'm just going to leave it up for a second and you want to make sure that you that you use the uh the shipping one right here whichever one is takes up the most size on your pc is the one that you want to use and you want to set it to high performance right here and this is the path right there and just make sure it's on high performance that's going to give you the best performance for your fortnite so i hope this video did help you all out if it did please consider dropping a like and subscribing as it really does help me out a lot and my name's shig i'll see you all in the next video and as always peace out